Hello, this is Alekius, and welcome back to Rule the Waves 2 as France espousing the new school of thought. Despite the best efforts of our Prime Minister, we do have quite a few light cruisers. Quite a few of them extended range, too. Quite a few mines, actually. And I forgot they had aircraft. And I think we are doing well. Certainly the war with Italy is... pretty one-sided. Without border changes. No. Large territories, there you go. Take Libya. Don't have enough points for Sicily. That's okay. Let's take a look at the Almanac. Good grief, Great Britain has a lot. Let's see, places I wouldn't mind going. Well, pretty much every single country has something I would not mind getting a few ships in, or colonies in. We're already everywhere all the time. But I like trying to control the med. I think England should be a priority. So should Germany. We'll fight one or both next. Hmm. Better submarine reliability. Bigger docks. Oh, we'll miss our allies. Better AP. Can we design an aircraft carrier? I think we can do a light one. I don't think we can actually do aircraft carriers yet. Yeah, we can't do purpose built. Can do the light ones though. Yep. I'll have to contemplate that here at some point. Ooh, 26? That's not bad at all. Not that we have the planes for it. Glorious. 9 16 inch guns. 11 and a half inch belt. 4 inch deck. Better than ours. Also a lot bigger, heavier, and more expensive. Oh, water torpedo mounts. Hey, new fighters. I don't think we have any fighters yet. Things that I care about, mostly maneuverability and firepower, a little bit of toughness. Shortish range, but uh, I don't really care about the range of fighters. Let's see, what flying boat do we have now? And one is a boat rather than kind of nimble. Carries a bomb load, not that that really matters.
Hey, naval secretary. And he likes destroyers. Hurrah. So let's figure out where our next destroyer will be. We have 1500. Do we have larger? No. 1500 tons to work with. Get rid of the cramped. Medium oil. Go for speed. Three triple mounts. Can we increase the tubes? Nope. No A directors, no medium AA. I think our destroyer should carry mine sweeping gear, not mines. No K K guns yet. We can do increased depth charge storage. Three singles, I don't think we can do doubles yet. I'm fine with three singles. I want torpedoes more than I want guns. Especially since we have such long range torpedoes. Get rid of No, I think we're kinda of fine with that setup. Three triples are plenty. Use the remaining weight for light guns. Put a pause on these three. Save up a little bit of money and build those 21. Sure, extra prestige. Go to the build screen. We want 12 plus 9. 21 destroyers. Wants to reduce naval spending. We have no unrest. So we'll push it. It'll be good for tension. Oh yeah, yeah, I'll take extra machinery. We commission a bunch of our submarines, which I think puts us at all the submarines that we have right now. Still have a lot of legacy coastal subs. They use superimposed turrets for heavy cruisers. Ah, oh, stop offering to sell us stuff. We can't afford it right now. <laughs> More HE though. More light, anti-aircraft, fighters are ready, oh just in time, the Hawker Hurricane, famous torpedo bomber. Now what we need is a swordfish that's an amazing dogfighter. All right, halt construction of everything. Mm, 
that way we'll get a modest increase. Lengthen torpedoes? No. I'm fond of my torpedo advantage. Reduced penalty from multiple ships firing at the same. Not sufficient. What happened? I have not been paying attention. A obsolete. Or my Corvettes are getting obsolete. Nineteen fourteen, nineteen twenty two. Well, they should still all be fine. South Pacific buy by two thousand tons. Sounds like one of my escorts is headed to the South Pacific. No, not Africa. Hey, Great Britain, I thumb my nose at you. Weight savings, improvement to the fighter. Go on, move to the South Pacific. I did it in the wrong order. Morris B. Secondary director for light cruisers, 18 inch guns. Sure, why not? Worth the price? Probably not, because. Am I likely to use 3 inch guns? Actually, I do use them as tertiary batteries quite a bit. I have no unrest. I'm quite happy to piss some people off. No, oh. our ship's overweight. Nope, I'm not selling you better submarines. Austrians, yeah, I'll sell them wherever they want. They are a non-entity to me. We have a new flying boat. It is slower, shorter ranged by barely anything, slightly more firepower. Sure, why not? I should probably build a few air bases. Especially as we'll soon be at war with Britain. They're already an active fleet. I want to move them. Keep the aging pre-dreads. Are they worth keeping? Two eighty a month. Could just scrap them, or I could put them out into the uh, colonies. Southeast Asia seems likely. Oh, 
All right, let's get you all moved up to Northern Europe. Prime Minister is nervous. And for all of you being a little bit old, Yes, I want to use fuel or coal, I mean. Just putting them through a refit. Hey, we have a new hero. Four new destroyers. I'll tell them to uh, toss it. Yes, I like the additional budget, but uh, the completely pointless and doesn't serve any purpose other than to be a score marker prestige is highly valued by me. Better torpedoes. Always pleasant. Well, we seem pretty committed to the British. We'll keep that up. Inclined belt is now an option. Austrians want to give us better 10 inch guns. Not likely to use those. But I'll still take them. No, oh, their latest Corvette. Very interesting. Got our new battle cruiser. Ah, oh, jeez. Naval secretaries eating up our entire budget. Better ASW is always welcome. Yeah, at least it gives... Oh no, that was from the battle cruiser fishing, wasn't it? Like, we got a little bit more budget, right? So, CL or CA. We've got quite a few CLs. Do I want to do a CA? That's pretty intense. It's expensive. But it'll chew up any light cruiser out there. We can use a... Uh, no. You know what? I'm going to go back to the light cruiser. And I think... My thought process is, let's build a light cruiser that is supposed to be a trade protection cruiser. Hey, dual purpose. So max will be six inch. Using normals, so I don't think we can do double turrets. The older ones are allowed with the um, protected cruiser scheme. 
Not with these guns, though. Do the aft superimpose. That one's easy. Gets us at least three. And then we can do... Q turret. I don't want the C turret. L turret, I think is. Yep, there it is. It gives us five six inch guns either side. We'll use a Q dual purpose high quality three inch or high quality four inch. Hmm. It's only 96 tons. Ah, oh, we can't dual purpose the double mounts though. And we'll take a director. Yeah, the dual purpose mounts are expensive. Let's do 6 inch. Find belt is more for long range combat. Deck is one and a half. It's probably reasonable. Do three inches of belt. For ships smaller than, oh, so we can't do a director. That's unfortunate. That'll get us to within 10 kilometers. It's a little bit of armor. Ah, we can't do that much. Three is max. Yep. Then three is what it will be. Do a flat deck. That'll save us a little bit. We'll accept 6,000 tons. Put a couple of Let's put an aircraft on it. We get we don't have a catap no catapult yet, so I'm actually leery to add it. Can we do a center line? W maybe. And maybe C. I have an odd position for torpedoes. That leaves me three tons to work with in the future. That leaves me 46, that's more reasonable. We will go with 6,000 tons. Alright, I am happy with this. Discard. Oh, oh, center line only on those. Can't use the mine sweeping gear either. All right, so put important starboard towards the aft, and important starboard forward. There we go. All okay. get that in two months and we'll build ten of them.
probably be way more expensive than what we can do. We just finished our battle cruisers, not that they're particularly new. US is building a battleship. Everyone's building battle cruisers. Got some destroyers, but those probably won't be part of a disarmament conference. Tempted to take the prestige, but disarmament conferences can be fun. Ah, man, should have taken the prestige. All right, 10 of these. Which is twice as much money than I can spend. Go ahead and start moving these to Southeast Asia. Oh yeah, the concept since I didn't really share it yet. The idea behind these was to build something that is threatening to larger ships, but is mostly meant to take out other cruisers and then use them as part of trade protection, but could also fulfill as an escort. Yeah, I don't care about the US right now. The last thing I need to do is to fight the two largest naval powers at the same time. Are you kidding me? Like you you the I'm not even done with the the Can you make up your mind? Is, it, is this a possibility? Guy's losing his mind. You want me to build all this stuff? You better give me some money. So that is 21 submarines being built. Good grief. Ooh. I'm getting the US involved. Or Germany. Ah, rat. Potez, boat, faster, more maneuverable, not as tough, longer ranged. Range pretty much takes it. Mobilize all our ships. Means nothing because it's already mobilized. Italy wants better ASW. Okay. Hey, more money. Ooh, and it is getting tense. I have a feeling we're going to lose some battle cruisers in this one. Oh, and our aging destroyers. It's a good thing we're building new ones. I have two light cruisers. These are the raiders. K-1 
keep the stars coming off the line. Aircraft catapult. I would love to build an air base. The prime, or, or sorry, the naval secretary stopped losing his mind and asking us to build stuff. Buying the rights to subdivision, trouble bottom. Yeah, sure. Double gum mounts on light cruiser. Like, these are the things that I wanted just as I was designing this. Killing me game. More AP, more torpedo damage, better, more reliable submarines, more HE. Wow. Get a lot of everything. Oh, tensions are coming down fast. Thumb our nose at Austria. Hey, more money. Oh yeah, there we go. That'll ratchet things up. I'll take the prestige, as much as we could use the money. Those last two destroyers going. Better fighter, significantly faster. Not nearly as tough. Eh, I'm not that interested. And we'll ask for a new fighter. Let's uh, go for maneuverability and speed. Go on speed, then maneuverability. Oh well. I do want an airbase. Probably at Cherbourg. Should it be at Brest? Brest and Dunkirk. That's a modest monthly cost. The other one going. At Dunkirk. There we go. They want reduction gear. Sure, why not? More range for the ships, that's of little consequence to me. Okay, I like better AA. We have our two airfields. Manage the air group. What we want. Add flying boats to eight. And 
12 fighters. Copy their group. Paste their group. Thank goodness they added that functionality. Then we have some airships down in the Mediterranean. Where is... Dalmatia Spalato. Ah. That kind of covers the middle of the Mediterranean fairly well. We'll leave it. Doesn't cost much. 22 a month. There's our 21 submarines. Or circulation, yes please. Well, let's get these cruisers rolling off the lines. Get four of them at a time. Superimposed destroyer guns, that's nice. Uh, no, I don't sell directors to anyone. Better armor. More destroyers. Better railroads, please. I would love the prestige, but this long-term prosperity for improving the uh, resources of the nation is very powerful. Approved director. All right. We've got some refits to do anyways. So let's get the two battleships refit. We want the improved director. Increased elevation. We can't fit an, a float plane on there. Well, that would be super useful if we could get one. But that'll require a refit that we can't quite do. 10 6 inch guns. Can we just shave this down? Do 10 5 inch guns, throw a pair of airplanes on there. Ugh, that looks terrible. How about an R? Alright, do the R. Then we'll throw, oh, dual purpose. Costs a lot, but it makes our three inch battery a little bit more useful. We can plus it up to a four inch battery. Throw on a director for our secondaries. Bump our secondaries back up to sixes. Now a little armor. And there we go. Four months, 8,000 total. Not too bad. Rebuild those two. We'll use them to relieve the heavy cruisers as we go through all of them. 
get the Montargis. Oh man. Now I remember these. And it's going to be hard to find the room to put an airplane on this. Or anything at all. And it'll be expensive to replace machinery. What do we do with these guys? I don't want to turn them into something else. See what we can do. We replace the machinery. We get 200 tons to work with. Uh, I don't know. It's going to end up being relatively expensive or one knot of extra speed and some AA. And is that really useful? Nah, not really. Bulge it out. And maybe we can throw on a plane as well. No, it looks like it'll be the R again. And then maybe we can get rid of the engine refit. Alright, let's take another look at this. We'll bulge it. Give you an airplane. Give you a catapult. Bring these up. Dual purpose. Director. Increased elevation. Clear out the below water mounts. Put on a pair of triples. Make those five. Give them gun shields. Hey, that works. She's a little bit more threatening to our counterparts now, but the uh, protection is not good. But I'll take it. A lot cheaper than the other way. Ah. Got to bump up the director. Bump down that. And we wanted dual purpose for the secondary, so we'll keep it to that. Nah, yeah, it'll work. It's fine. We'll do all of those together. Halt all current cruiser production. Outside of those. Oh my goodness. Stop. Better 15 inch guns, fighter prototypes. More range on this one. This one's tougher. 
pick the tough one. Range isn't that important for a fighter as far as I'm concerned. Good grief. 21 more submarines. You're waiting two months while I get these light cruisers. Cotton in Japan, sure, you're a hero. Carriers operate as a separate force. Now we have the money. Add 21 more submarines. I don't mind submarines. Submarines are easy come, easy go. We can even scrap the old ones if we need to. Yes, yes. That's going to suck up our budget now. They want better machinery in Japan, sure. Do you want to sell me a new fighter? Made of tissue paper, but as fast. I thought our new one was 131. One's a little bit more maneuverable. Hmm, not that interested. But with that, I think I'm running out of time. This episode didn't quite go as I expected, but uh, it's gone well. Our Secretary of the Navy's lost his marbles, and I can't wait till he rotates out. But we've made it to 1925. We may go back to war with Italy. Like... England has proven difficult to get keep tensions high. We'll see what happens. Um, but until then, I appreciate you staying till the end. Let me know what you think. Make suggestions on who we should go to war with. What kind of ships we should build next if our naval secretary ever stops giving us new orders. And uh, I will see you next time. Take care.